as more Indians move up the energy ladder and India's per capita electricity demand continues to increase, electricity distribution companies are up for some big challenges. For example, as loads increase, how do they optimize investments in transmission upgrades? At the distribution level, how do they set up new infrastructure in congested areas? How do they manage peak loads which may become increasingly unpredictable? And how do they ensure reliable supply to critical loads such as those needed in hospitals? Not just these, India has globally committed to an ambitious goal of 500 gigawatts of renewable energy installed capacity by 2030. But how will India's grid manage such a large share of renewables which are intermittent in nature, meaning they are not constantly available or predictable? The answer to all the above challenges could lie in one of the most promising technologies, battery energy storage systems, which are essentially rechargeable systems that can store energy from solar arrays or the electric grid and discharge this energy later during times of high demand. Beyond balancing the intermittency of renewable energy, batteries offer multiple solutions. As a fast-acting reserve, they can inject energy whenever, wherever there is a shortfall at the distribution level. For example, they can be used to meet rising demand in congested areas, service peak loads in areas with distribution capacity constraints, and cater to critical loads in hospitals and industry reducing their reliance on costly and polluting DG sets. Overall, batteries can help utilities differ high investments in upgrading their electricity infrastructure. As a local source of energy, they will save transmission and distribution losses. And finally, they will help utilities save money through lower power procurement during peak hours. In a future scenario, batteries installed in electric vehicles can facilitate bi-directional energy transfer from and to EVs by enabling vehicle-to-grid technology. With all these benefits, batteries can make the grid more flexible by acting both as a load and a source of energy supply. However, the choice of battery technology becomes crucial when servicing different applications ranging from near real-time response to daily management. The most commonly used chemistries today are lithium-ion, advanced lead acid, sodium sulfur and flow batteries. Each of these has distinct power and energy density, efficiency, life cycle and charge and discharge rates. Terry has undertaken several feasibility studies for this technology for utilities in Delhi and West Bengal, including pre-field testing in its in-house lab facility in Gurugram, Haryana. On ground, it is setting up pilots in collaboration with utilities in Delhi to demonstrate distinct applications such as peak shaving, power backup and energy arbitrage at a distribution network level. Moving forward, battery energy storage systems bring a win-win proposition both for the distribution sector and electricity consumers. While consumers can get improved quality and reliability of power, utilities can optimize their power purchase portfolio. They can integrate higher quantum of renewable energy and meet their renewable purchase obligations. While doing so, they will not only enhance India's energy security, but also take India closer to its ambitious climate and renewable energy goals for 2030.